Hey guys, it is Pyro again, and I am playing off of Axis again just because I can. Haha. -ha. This is, again, my god. <laughs> and this is episode 3 where I will either pick Rhino or Valkyr. Hmm, such a bad combination. I have no shields, no health, but extremely high damage and a rage mode that makes me take no damage. Or I have extremely high health, extremely high shields, slow slow attacking, but can pretty much rampage through everything. Hum. I think I'm gonna go with the tank. Just for right now, but to do this, I'm gonna switch his guns. There we go. That's all I need to switch. Okay, so, um... Rhino. Rhino is a big heavy geared warframe and I gotta change that or else it's gonna bother me you can still jump like the others most people say oh he's too slow but I, I don't see it I think he's actually quite okay when it comes to speed so I don't really uh, change that at all I like giving him uh, the green and red like I do with almost all of my warframes just because it looks like uh, oh yeah I forgot he has blue on him too it looks like he has armor, and then his inside is coming out, which is the red. I have a heart on my back. Uh, I do that to all my Warframes to tell the enemy where to aim, because even if they get a lucky shot, they're still going to get shredded. So, <laughs> yep, that's that. Um, thinking, because last time it was so successful, I might just go through uh, Void again. Yeah, I am. I'm going to go through Void. Hmm. Should I do a capture? Capture somebody, or... Yeah, I'm gonna do uh, the same exterminate as last time. But with the different characters, so you can see all the different... Whoa! Level 30 through 40 exterminate. Do you remember the die. old war, Operator? Ordis seems to have misplaced those memories. Ordis, it might be because you're crazy, but I don't know nothing. I am a fish. Swimming my way along in space. Being amazing. Whee! You are not alone. Oh this tower boy, is you full of life forms, place. all corrupted uh, by the neural sentry. So, Clean ooh, out. already. Thing about uh, Rhino is, look up there in the right. He is not level thirty like my others right now. Neither is Valkyr. Um, I still have Shade with me. Cause Shade's my favorite. And um, good thing about Rhino, his first move I might show you guys once, but his second move is the one you really want for Rhino. Rhino you can get easily with the Jackal, is a enemy that takes a little bit, but is easy to farm for Rhino's parts. The reason why uh, Iron Skin is so useful is that. You see the 100 down there in the right uh, bottom corner? Uh, the 100 on his second move symbolizes how much the armor can take. see my heart in there just kind of like getting suffocated by the iron but um yeah so now that I'm all up in armor that failed all right so my second move I just showed you the first move is a rhino charge hitting everyone slamming them to a wall It's useful if it's useful if you go and you get caught in a situation you don't want to be in, and there's guys that you cannot escape from. You can ram through them real fast and you keep running. Uh, 
Now just gotta save up a bit of energy to throw the, uh, the next one. Ooh, Thumper. Not bad. Okay. But I would like energy. If you guys have been watching the uh, one the videos I'm putting on Axis's channel, you might like them. I would say if you haven't started from episode one, go for it. It's a uh, magnet, and then I uh, have Ember, which is my all-time favorite because I'm Pyro, and then I start to run with Light, which is right now. Oh yes! <laughs> Think about the shotgun. Um, I, <laughs> I put some fun stuff on it, so... It does high damage. There we go. For those of you that already like Axis's video, uh, videos, I certainly hope you'll like this one. Like I said in my uh, last go through of this, if you really uh, like my videos and uh, how I talk and everything like that, ooh, what was that? Uh, I will have more. We've decided you are bad for business. Oh. Okay. Okay, you decided I was bad for business. This was uh. Whoa! This has never happened before, so... Oh my gosh! I don't know if I'm gonna live this. What's that? Uh, I might need some help. Alright, uh, something that I learned how to do in the beginning was I got these special little things that spawn a, uh, mag. So my first, my first character. Mag, come on. There we go. Okay. So I might actually have to use my mag, and she uses the skills and everything. But yeah, she's uh, same health and all, and she will help me out on killing all these little strong guys. I do not have my iron skin on right now, so I'm just kind of having to run away, which I mentioned in my first video, I'm very good at knowing when to run to re, uh, re revive the uh, shield a bit before running back in. Mag is really useful if you get the uh, secondary ones for the helpers, because that is not an online player, that's my um, specter, which is just a helper that comes in when I order it. Uh, these things are so hard to kill. I d actually do not know what's happening, so I'm not, I'm not freaking out about it because I know these things are strong, but not strong enough, I guess. Okay, right, perfect. I got enough to get my armor back. Now I can take this one out, probably without really care. Everything just got all weird again, so I'm gonna guess that that one weird guy's gonna be back. <laughs> I'm surprised I lived that, because those things were pretty strong. Uh, so let's continue our mission. That's like that did not just happen. So that was weird. Hi guys. Oops. I uh, shredded them. Um. Uh, anyone wanna play? Play? 
Anybody want to play a game? A game of catch my weapon. But uh, that's okay. He he didn't need to play. That's 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 completely fine. Uh, where is this guy? Ooh, mag, you took him out. All right, so. Yeah, that's, that's uh, the mag I was a little while ago. I think with a few color changes, you have the original color on, even though my mag had the green and red. Um, I'm just going to try to get more energy. Sorry for uh, not saving the energy before, but those things were hard, so I kind of had to use it. Bye. Oh, perfect. Maybe this is energy. Any energy? Nope. Okay. Oh, you're not fun. Oh, you're gonna explode. Well, okay then. Aren't you a Rudy? Oh, okay, let's not. You too? Okay. Again, shotguns are extremely useful, but if you have a normal character, I wouldn't advise using a shotgun. I mean, I, I know people do just because they like the really high damage, but the uh, not uh, the not like super heavy characters, they they really are better with like fast shooting machine guns. I use the numbers, but <laughs> all right, cool. I have enough energy to show you guys my this skill. It's called Roar. This is why people will like you if you're online playing this, because Roar, any people that you are around get a damage uh, boost for a short period of time. Really useful. Um, especially it's like, you're somebody that will get a really high damage pull, and then just go all out with it. Or a really high, uh, energy pull. My energy pulls are usually really small for my characters, since I don't really rely on, uh, special moves that often. Unless it's like, World on Fire, but that's like, Ember. Um, if you're somebody that, uh, it's just starting out, you just got the character. Um, I would advise you to not use your uh, energy like crazy if you have your second move unlocked. Because the longer, um, uh, the more damage you take while you're using your iron skin, right when iron skin goes off, you're going to want enough energy to get it right back on because of uh, higher rounds. That's why this character is so useful when playing with people. Because iron skin is extremely useful. Oh, fire abilities, huh? Like I said last time, I would like if you if you like my videos, which I, I would hope you do. I mean, even if you don't play this, I'm pretty sure you would just like to watch them because it's a really cool game to play. But I play all sorts of things, not just this. But for the sum of what uh, I do for Axis, because I Axis like these more or less, I'm going to be playing this mostly. Uh, just two more. Two more with this. 
shotgun. Ooh. So, uh, I would like, like I was saying, I would like you to comment on if you would like me to create my own stuff and get my own channel. Because I just, uh, I just play off of Axis right now, which is not bad. I like Axis often. But I just want to know if I do make a channel, people will actually be watching it. Alright. So, thing that I just saved up for you guys, the, uh, his Warframe ability. Really useful. Thing about this is if there's people that are strong, you stomp, and if there's strong enough to win the stomp, they're stuck in the air long enough to take them out. It is a very useful move if you're in a swarm of people. And that is Rhino's Warframe ability. I'm going to keep the rest instead of using like Roar or my other moves, just in case, uh, like I said earlier, my um... Why are you running? Oh dude, he's doing some Michael Jackson stuff. Hardcore moonwalking over there. Alright, so... Just like to these videos if you really do uh, want me to make my own, or not just liking, just tell me if you like my videos. Don't be like straight up, oh my god, you like the best thing ever. But I would like some uh, say in if I should make my own stuff. Oh, by the way. That was actually pretty funny. Take them all out in one time. Uh, oh, big guy. Oh, uh. Ooh, launcher. Um, just in case you don't know, uh, for, uh, Rhino, his second move, again, why it's so useful, is because of, uh, the iron skin. It's, um, designed to where, uh, if you have it on, and like the big characters try to use their slam up, oh, get closer, get closer, get inside. If they try to use their slam, it does nothing to you. Same with uh, laser walls; it does nothing if you like run through it. Depending on how uh, how much it is, like if it's at only like 11, it might uh, break through or be shielding you, or not kill you, but hurt you. But there's a low chance for that. Yeah, it's it's pretty pretty good for keeping you alive, it's very good for uh, getting out of tough situations. It's kept me from dying way more the times than it should. Oh yeah, another thing I love about the shotgun is uh, its ability to launch your opponents. Make them fly backwards. But you know it.
Uh, one thing I would suggest if you're going to use the shotgun is uh, getting a uh, the ammo drum. I think it's pretty, pretty sure that's what it's called for the shotgun. And um, it, it makes sure that you shoot more because uh, my mag is 6 because I haven't put ammo drum on there yet. But uh, having to reload after a couple shots each time, it gets annoying. Uh, it's a real annoying real fast, so that's why you get a really good uh, melee or melee weapon, some people say it differently, so that you can just like blend them all up, shred them all. I know there's gonna be like some people actually play this game. Their instant thoughts can be like, oh man, this guy's doing it all wrong. But, you know, I have my own way of working stuff. Especially because. And when you're in the void and you're actually instant killing everything, it's not bad. Why are you missing? Hey, can you, uh, can you die? What the heck? There we go. Alright. That guy, for some reason, just did not want to get shot. Then again, two guys. Uh, okay, we have one last guy. I'm going... Uh, once this one goes off, I'm going to show you where you can get uh, this guy. Oop, it's... Oh, yes. Okay, come here. Come here. Come here. All targets Whee! down. Get okay. to extraction. Actually, I can just explain it. Uh, explain it. It is a uh, place where there is a boss called the Another Jackal. Job well executed. Again, uh, like I said, Jackal very easy to kill as long as you have people with you. They don't have to be that good, but just keep your uh, keep your distance because the Jackal slams and it forces you away. Okay, right, so all I really need to say is um <laughs> this is episode three and I would like uh like really if you like uh access uh access videos you should check out those they're really cool. Uh my other videos you should check them out, they're not bad. And um like and subscribe, tell me if I should make my own channel and anything like that. So Arrow out.